tarehe kumi mwezi wa Septemba mwaka huu on 10th September this year the Lord gave me an assignment to pray for some leaders in Kenya Because the Lord told me he has taken care of Kenyan political leadership in 2027 and therefore he told me pray for these people for the sake of the future of Kenya. Meaning if we don't pray for them the future of, of Kenya may become different from the future that God wants. Muna kumbuka nilikuwa hapa. I announced ujaguzi wa 2027 uliisha 2013. Nitaerezea kinabii siku ya leo. Hallelujah. Naongea 2032. Tukienda tukielekea 2032. Wale watu wanatembea kinabi Nitaomba muendere kumbea Watoto wenu mulio waza Lakini specifically mungu Alinipa majina matano Ya kuombea Aliniambia Tuwaombe sana Watu kama Ndindi nyoro <tos> Alafu wakaniambia tuombe watu kama Mtula Kilonzo Junior. Akaniambia tuombe watu kama Johnson Sakaja. Akaniambia tuombe mtu kama Cleovas Malala. Na akaniambia tuombe watu kama Susan Kiika. Aki niongeza majina, nitarudi. Mimi, sijasema watakuwa viongozi. Nidiambiwa, tuwaombe. Lakini unajua unabi, prophecy is progressive. Aleluya. Alo? Muwaombe sana sana. Mwaombe sana watu hao kwa sababu ya future ya Kenya. And we were supposed to pray. Atuombi kwa achiri ya siyasa ya Kenya. Tunaomba kwa achiri ya uongosi wa taifa la Kenya. Sometimes our leaders are produced by political systems. But what God wants for Kenya in the future... It's not just politicians. God wants Kenya to have leaders. Praise God. Na muna kumbuka vizuri. Vire buwana hali niambia. Sichui kama kuna mtu wameombea wale watu ambao buwana hali sema. Do you even remember the names? Hello? Do you remember the names? But you have not done any prayer so far. Listen to me, child of God. The plan of God has to do with the future. It may not do with your expectation, but it has to do with what he wants. Praise God. Praise him again. Do you remember what God said? He said we pray for honorable Ndindi nyoro. You remember? Yes. He also said that we pray for His Excellency Johnson Sakaja to pray for them. What they become and what they don't become not being priority. God said you pray for 
hususan kihika is our assignment as a church i don't know about the country we have to do our duty praise god and the lord said we pray for cleobas malara a man that did not win his election in kakamega but god said pray for him And the same God said, we pray for Mtula Kilonzo Jr. Hallelujah. We have a duty to pray for those people. Rest rest about pray. I am I'm asking you to pray for a Kenya that is beyond 2032. I'm not asking you to pray for today. If you are a child of the future, lift up your hands and pray. Pray for the names I've told you. Make your prayer. My Father, in the name that's above every name, I cover this country, Kenya, in the future and even now. I pray that your will be done in 2032, 2037. When we cross over to Vision 2030 of Mze Kibaki, that these Kenyans who exist may have an experience of the spiritual nature of Vision 2030. My Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, I pray for Mwishmiwa Ndindi Nyoro. I pray for Johnson Sakaji. I pray for Clovis Marara. I pray for Susan Kihika. And I pray, my Father, for Mtula Close the junior. My father, in the name that's above every name, I cover the entire country and the entire region of Africa. In Jesus' mighty name, we are prayed. Amen. 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 Pia Yesma Kofi Mazuri.